If you are always buying the cheapest option for yourself, you are telling yourself that the cheapest option is what you deserve. Hello my favorite ladies and welcome back to the channel. My name is Urania and I'm very happy to have you here. In today's video, we're talking about how you can live a life of luxury and abundance. Ladies, let's get straight into today's video. If you clicked on this video, you are ready to attract abundance and luxury into your life. And I think that is great. And it's so great because it shows that you are a person who wants more and better for yourself. And it's okay to want more for yourself. To me, luxury means quality, comfort, beauty, having options. And what does luxury mean to you? Let me know in the comment section below. Thankfully, there are many ways that you can manifest abundance and luxury into your life. And that's exactly what this video is all about. So let's start with point number one. Number one, identify your limiting beliefs. Being abundant begins with feeling abundant. And that's why you want to be honest with yourself first. How do you truly feel about luxury, money, and abundance? Do you have any limiting beliefs that are holding you back from attracting more abundance into your life? Do you have a scarcity mindset and believe that there will never be enough for you? Or do you believe that you don't deserve to have luxury in your life because you never saw your family experiencing a life of abundance and luxury? Or you might feel guilty for wanting more and better for yourself. What is truly holding you back? What are those limiting beliefs that you have? Take your time to journal about it and to identify it. You need to know what is holding you back in order to move forward. Number two, adopt new beliefs. After you've identified your limiting beliefs, you then want to flip those beliefs into something positive, something that supports you and something that makes you feel good. You want to adopt new beliefs that support your goals of living a life of luxury and abundance. If your limiting belief is that you are not worthy of having a life of luxury, change that into, I am worthy of living a life of luxury. I am worthy of attracting abundance and I am deserving of having luxury and comfort in my life. So this point is very important because you can say that you want to live a life of luxury. You want all these amazing things in your life. But if deep down inside of you, you don't believe that you are worthy of having it, it's going to be very difficult for you to attract it into your life. So change your beliefs. Start feeling worthy of having what you want. Number three, choose luxury right now. Some of you might think that it's impossible to live a life of luxury and abundance if you don't have millions in your bank account. And I am here to tell you that that is not true. There is always a way that you can attract more luxury into your everyday life and experience it for yourself. And choosing luxury and abundance in your everyday life is actually very simple. If you enjoy drinking tea, pick a good quality organic tea and drink it from a beautiful teacup. When you are drinking your water, instead of drinking it from a plastic bottle, pour it in a nice glass and add a slice of lime or mint leaves. Luxury is also about the details. And there are many ways that we can add small details of luxury into our everyday life. Ladies, and now it's time for a question. How do you attract luxury and abundance into your everyday life? In a simple way. Let me know in the comment section below and let's inspire one another. Number four change your language. Stop saying things as I am broke, I cannot afford this, or it's too expensive. You need to eliminate these words and these sentences from your vocabulary if your goal is to manifest more abundance and luxury into your life. It comes down to understanding the power of our words. Our words are so powerful. Start using your words in your advantage instead of in your disadvantage. Be very alert on how you speak about the topics of luxury, abundance, and money, because this is going to help you to shift the way that you think about these topics as well. Number five, get the best that you can afford. If you are always buying the cheapest option for yourself, you are telling yourself that the cheapest option is what you deserve. And of course, going for a bargain is fine but you don't want to make the cheapest option your standard. Instead, allow yourself the best that you can afford and that you are comfortable with spending. Raise your own standards. This will attract abundance and signal that this is the lifestyle that you want to live and that you deserve. 
And this doesn't mean that you have to go for the most expensive option, not at all. But this means that you buy the healthiest and best quality food that you can afford. And this, for example, also means that you book the best and most beautiful hotel that you can afford when you're traveling. Always make sure that you are comfortable with what you're spending, but don't always go for the lowest and cheapest option for yourself. Number six, visualize. A very powerful tool to help change the way that you see yourself and give yourself permission to feel abundant is visualization. Give yourself a peaceful moment every day and imagine yourself in your dream home, driving your dream car, having your dream career, and being surrounded by the people that you love. You want to create your life of luxury, comfort, and abundance in your mind first before it can become your reality. And something that can help you with that is to create a vision board. Besides your real vision board, something that I've really been enjoying lately is to have a vision board on Pinterest. And every single day I post something that has to do with luxury and abundance in my dream life. By doing this every day, I'm connected with it and I can see and literally feel what I want my life to look like. So having a Pinterest board where you pin something every single day can be very powerful too. And it's obviously fun to do. Number seven, create a luxurious environment. Add luxury elements into your home and into your environment to attract abundance to you. For inspiration, when you think about a luxury hotel, a luxury spa or a restaurant experience, what elements of those experiences can you add to your daily life? Think about luxurious bed sheets that are being used in hotels or luxurious shower gel or a nice soft bathrobe that is being used in a spa. Or can you get better cutlery and lit candles to create a luxurious dining experience for yourself at home? Number eight, say your affirmations. In order to attract abundance into your life, you must start thinking and feeling abundance. And you want to start speaking abundance into your existence. Pick out affirmations that feel good to you, that make you excited. And believe that what you are affirming is on its way to you. Instead of a quote, ladies, now it's time for an affirmation. I am deserving of abundance in all areas of my life. I am deserving of abundance in all areas of my life. Number nine, be open to receive. How do you receive a compliment? When someone is telling you that they like your dress, are you the person that is saying, oh, this old thing? Oh no. Or are you saying, thank you so much and truly appreciating and welcoming the compliment? Because think about it, if you have difficulties accepting something as simple and beautiful as a compliment, how will you accept all the abundance into your life? So be open to receive compliments, gifts, and acts of service. Be thankful for it and appreciate it. That will help you to attract even more into your life. Number 10, pray for abundance. Praying can help you create more inner peace. It can help you to be more centered and it can add more positivity into your life. So if you want to attract abundance and luxury and prosperity, pray about it. Pray so that your desires can turn into physical manifestations. Number 11, love to spend money. You can spend money from a place of fear and think about how expensive something is, or you can spend money from a place of abundance and be happy and grateful that you can afford the item. And this counts for buying a new outfit, but this also counts for paying your bills, including your electricity bill or your water bill or your rent. Make sure that when you pay these bills, you are doing it with a good feeling because the fact that you can turn on the lights in your home, that you have running water and that you have a roof above your head is something to be very happy and grateful for. And this will help you to train your mind to see abundance in many different ways. Number 12, be happy for other people's abundance and prosperity. Be genuinely happy for people that have abundance and luxury in their life and for people that are succeeding in life. This is going to put you in an energy of abundance and it's going to make you feel good. And when you feel good, when you are in that energy, you're going to attract more goodness into your life. Being happy for other people 
also means that we are letting go of comparison and jealousy. Look at the people that have what you would also like to have and see it as a reflection of what is to come for you. Be happy for them because there is more than enough abundance for all of us. Number 13, practice gratitude. If you're constantly looking for the next best thing and constantly focusing on what you don't have in your life yet, you will always be unfulfilled. That is why in order to attract abundance into your life, one of the easiest steps is to already look at your life and see what type of abundance and luxury you already have and appreciate it. Be grateful for it. And the energy of being grateful, which is very powerful, is going to help you to attract more abundance and luxury and all the things that you want into your life. Be grateful for all that you have right now. Number 14, to attract abundance and luxury into your life, is to be generous. Besides gratitude, being generous, so generosity, is another very powerful and beautiful habit that you want to adopt to attract a life of luxury and abundance. And besides giving in the form of money and material things, there are many ways that you can give to other people. You can give your time, your love, your kindness or your knowledge so start being more generous today and offer your kindness your love and your help to others number 15 take action we can say our affirmations we can pray we can visualize and i think that these things are very powerful because they are guiding us towards our desires but you need to take action. The moment you're getting this feeling, this epiphany, or your intuition is telling you to go somewhere or try something out or go to this event, you want to go and do it. Take action. The tips that I shared with you in today's video are more about how to adopt a mindset of abundance and giving yourself permission to indulge in luxury. Because I truly believe it all starts with our mindset and with our beliefs. I hope that you enjoyed today's video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Ladies, thank you so much for watching. I would love to see you here next week, same time, same channel. Have a lovely week. Bye ladies.